A fire on Milwaukee's north side leaves more than 50 people without a place to sleep tonight. The Red Cross putting up some residents in a place kind of out of the ordinary. Our Christina Van Zels is live downtown Milwaukee with where those people slept on Saturday night. Christina, fill us in. Mary, at that time of night, the Red Cross was able to bring 17 people to spend the night at their office in downtown Milwaukee. Now, since then, they have opened a shelter here at Redeemer Lutheran Church. Now, this fire comes after the Red Cross spent the weekend installing hundreds of smoke detectors on the city's south side. Our teams were contacted that a 30 unit building, approximately 60 plus people, uh, were displaced after a fire. Dozens of residents at this Tetonia Avenue apartment building woke up to a nightmare, a fire leaving about 60 residents with no place to stay. It's just been very steady with these apartment fires and these multi-unit fires um, in the last two years. We're gonna force open a lot of these doors. Milwaukee fire crews responding to an apartment fire just before 10 Saturday night. And at that time of night, with a short notice, the Red Cross stepped in, putting at least 17 people up in their downtown office. But that was just the best, easiest way to, to get folks somewhere safe, somewhere where they could have some of that uh, short-term lodging, making sure they have the, the, the essentials taken care of. Red Cross officials say it's not conventional, but flexibility is important. Sunday, the organization opened up a shelter at Redeemer Lutheran Church. It was somber. You know, I mean, people people were understanding of, of you know, not knowing exactly how long they may be displaced from this building, but people were having lunch. They were looking after their neighbors. Our volunteers were talking with them. The Red Cross says a lot of the displaced residents have functional and access needs. Many use a wheelchair. And while the fire remains under investigation, there is a sense of togetherness at the shelter Sunday. People do rally around each other, do help each other out when it comes down to it, when it comes to helping our neighbors through the worst. Fire crews say one person was taken to the hospital. The Red Cross is expecting at least a dozen people to spend the night at the shelter again here at Redeemer Lutheran Church. The cause of that fire is still under investigation. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Christina Van Zelst, Fox 6 News. So nice to hear about that togetherness in spite of everything. All right, Christina, thank you for that.